Yeah, I think the big thing is Ben. You know, now that you got Kyrie Irving, uh, obviously in line. Now you, what you got to do is you got to get Ben Simmons. Well, how do you get Ben Simmons? I think Kevin Durant and Kyrie Irving got to put their arms around him. If you're going to have a championship team, your three best players, your three superstars have to be on the same page. You can't have Kyrie in one direction, KD in one direction, and Ben Simmons in one direction. Those two guys, those two veteran net players, have to go and basically. If Ben Simmons is healthy, embrace him and bring him into the loop. Because any championship team, if your best players, if your superstars are not on the same page, I don't care how talented you are individually, collectively you will not play at a championship caliber level. So, to me, I think the next step is KD basically, in a way, by not participating in the Kyrie conversation, got him back. Now those guys have got to put their arms around Ben Simmons. Okay, so, Zach, I know you're skeptical about this Nets team, but let's live in a world where Ben Simmons, KD, and Kyrie are all healthy. They're all playing full-time. In your mind, what can this team be? Well, what, has that world existed? Where is that world? <laughs> are we on it? Is, it? is it this planet? Like, yeah, is this team a championship-caliber team? Like, we just saw the Celtics sweep the Nets out of the playoffs. Did people forget that that happened? I realize Ben Simmons didn't play that series. The Celtics aren't going anywhere. The Bucks aren't going anywhere. The Clippers are reloading. They just get, are probably getting John Wall. The Nuggets are back. The Warriors aren't going anywhere. Can this team be championship contenders? I mean, maybe on paper, sure. There are actual basketball games on an actual basketball court where these things get decided. And I'm just tired of talking about what the Nets could be if, 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 if. The Nets have never been except for one playoff series against the Celtics with Harden, Kyrie, and KD when they were completely unstoppable. We've never seen it. Ben Simmons hasn't played basketball since he passed up a dunk to dump it off to Matisse Steibel. That was the end of his Sixers tenure. He hasn't played since then. Kyrie Irving played 29 games last year. They got swept in the playoffs. Like, all these other teams are doing normal basketball things and building normal championship teams that play basketball. The Nets, for me, are out of that are out of that tier until we see it, and I'm not talking about it until we see it. I've been as big a Nets skeptic as anybody, and mm -hmm. for all that Zach said, and he's right about all of it, they were this much of Kevin Durant's foot away from potentially winning a title two years ago. Uh, like, it's they, the talent two is Two years ago. Who cares? I, I don't care anymore. Hey, I, <laughs> I, I was the one saying all last year this team was not good enough. I agree with you. But from their perspective, this is what they wanted. Kyrie's back on a one-year deal. It's time for them to prove it. We'll see if they can prove it. And you know what? We are far from done in talking about KD, Kyrie, and all of this. What a story this is. Kyrie back in Brooklyn. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.